Jones. I am eight years old. First, I have a magic trick to show you. It is the heart! Hi, Professor Marshall. Hi. Hi, I'm Oliver. I work at the Queen's Cardiopulmonary Unit. Cool. What is it we're going to do? A heart experiment. A heart experiment. I see you have a cool picture there. Do you want to show the people? Um, yes, um, uh, that's a love heart. That's a human heart. The human heart looks more like a, a strawberry with red leaves. What are we going to need for our experiment? Um, well, four straws. I mean, three bottles. Three bottles. We don't need straws. We do. Okay. Four straws. Yes, we do. So two lids. These, these lids I've marked on two holes on each. Now on this one, these are two large holes. And this one, a large one small. Now the large holes have to fit the straw through. And what else do we need? Liquid. No, I wonder how we could do that. That. That's. Could you want to make it look like blood? Yep. Okay. Because I am the real scientist. That's true. Now, in the lab, I use transfer pipettes a lot, but at home, we have a turkey baster. And you might have one too. Okay, so now we have two bottles that are around about 80% full and one that's empty. Now, this liquid is red. What does it not have in this liquid, Professor Marshall? So, the things that it doesn't have are red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets, which mm. form scabs. That's right, that's what platelets do. So in a heart, you have four chambers. What are those four chambers called, Professor Marshall? Well, left and right, atrium. Yeah. Left and right, ventrum. Ventricle, not ventricle. Ventricle. <laughs> ventricle. Okay. So in between the atria and the ventricles, you have what are they called? Um, valves. Valves. That's right. What does a valve do? Stop the blood from going the wrong direction. Going the wrong direction. Okay. So the model heart that we have here, we have one atrium, one ventricle, and a body. We're going to see how the valves work to make sure that the blood flows in the right direction and into the body. And never the wrong direction. Never the wrong direction. That can cause problems. That's like right. heart murmurs. And if you have a leaky valve, then I suggest you go and see your local friendly cardiologist. They better be friendly. So now we're going to put these caps on these bottles and the straws thusly. Turn the bottle. Okay, so now we have our heart all put together. Now I've made sure I've used hot glue to try and stop any leaks from our valves. Hot! Hot! If I close this valve here and Professor Marshall squeezes, this is what happens. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. The blood goes into the body. Okay, pause. And then if I switch and close this valve and open the next one, let go. blood comes from the atrium into the ventricle. Switch again. Squeeze. Stop. Release. Release. That's right. Squeeze. Stop, stop. I hope you have enjoyed our experiment about the heart.